been asked to give a bit of a rundown on how to create buttons within the UCCNC screen set, so I'll try my best to try and explain how you go about doing that. You have to first enter the screen editor, so you go into configuration, general settings, and then down here, you've got edit screen. So click on that, it will bring up a box. Just move him out of the way for the minute, don't press anything else. You want to create a button on a particular screen that you're using here or if you want to copy a button in particular you then have to press shift and then at the same time as holding down shift select the menu page that you want to bring up i'll try and do that one-handed Okay, so that's the probe screen. Now in particular, this is the question that I was being asked, is how to create that button there on the main run screen. So then you then click on that. Now you've got to be careful here because as you can see up here, that's an LED. So you want to shift that LED out of the way. Click on it again. I'm pretty sure there's another LED under that, yep. Shift that one out of the way and then click on the button. No, still another LED there. Shift him out of the way. Right, there's your button there. That's the information regarding the button. Now, button number is what we need to know, 821. You need to write that down. Once you have your button, number information shift your leds back to where they were don't leave them sitting out in the open otherwise your screen set will save that okay so once you've got your um, information off that identifier as part of that uh, screen editor screen so you're looking for your your button number and your picture number so that your picture in the button obviously can marry up we want to go to our run screen, which is shift, hold shift down and press the run button. So as, as you can see on my screen, it's already there. I've already done this, but I'll create another one just to show you guys what I've done. So you go into create or delete, and you'll see here button, push that once, move your screen out of the screen out of the way, and there's a button underneath. So we can put him anywhere except for in that graphics screen. It'll always be in behind that if you try it. You can't put it up there. So I'm just going to sit it down here for the moment just so I can show you what to do. So once you've created the button, we need to populate the information in the identifier. So beside button number is 821. Picture number that relates to that button, 265. Press enter. Come down and press apply settings and we'll see what happens now that's what comes up the reason for that is this toggle type here so you need to change that to true apply settings and there it is you can then position that any way you like on the screen uh, i'm not going to save it there but i will show you where you save it so up here in the screen editor you go well if it You've obviously pressed apply settings, so they're done. You come across the file, and you'll go save screen set. So I don't want to save it, because I don't really want it like that. Um, but then you can exit your screen editor, and that button there is now linked to the start probing button that's on the probing menu. I hope that helped you.